Hi guys, taking the opportunity that everyone else is out of the house, I decided to do a small unboxing of another toy. If you've seen my previous episode, my daughter decided for a Lego similar set from AliExpress and since it's a Chinese copy, it's much cheaper. So I decided to take the remaining budget and buy some other toys. And here's one of the first packages. It's one of those UFOs similar to the fairy drone you might have seen in my previous video. The one that's controlled with your hand underneath. But since the propellers are enclosed in this UFO shaped cage, they won't be bouncing around on the furniture, walls and so on. So I guess this shouldn't fall as often as that doll did. So let's take a look inside. As you can see, it's packaged really well. So as in all my movies, if you want something similar, of course you'll find the link underneath this movie. So you can buy the same. Already open this. Okay. So here we have a USB connector for charging, an infrared diode, so I believe they should work exactly the same as the doll with your hand underneath, and a power on switch. So hopefully this is charged and we'll be able to test it. If not, we've got a cable for charging as part of a set and we'll charge it in a minute. And according to the instruction, it's controlled exactly the same as the fairy doll. The lights are on, but unfortunately nothing's happening, so I guess we do need to charge it. Turns out the drone is actually charged. I just had to read the instruction. How do you start it? And you start it by throwing it down. The drone also has sensors on the sides, so it prevents it from hitting anything, although it did fall right now. I guess the batteries are probably not charged enough, but let's see again. Okay. So it looks that if you put your hand underneath, it assumes you want it to land and it stops the motors. So let's see again. Oh, 
so I thought it didn't work, but it does. So it looks like batteries are dying, so we need to charge it up. So as I said earlier, of course you'll find the link below. Really, really cool toy. Unfortunately, not enough time for this to come in for Easter, but obviously it would be a cool toy for Christmas. So that's it for today. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and see you again soon.